Hi there, and welcome back to our Dark Souls 3 series. Today I'm going to be showing you how to duplicate items in Dark Souls 3. So, the uh, first method I'm going to show you will allow you to duplicate one stack of, a cer of certain items. And then the second method I'm going to show you allows you to duplicate seven stacks of an item. So, first thing you want to do is make sure you have the same password as your friend. And then also put down your red sign. So then you're just going to go ahead and grab the stuff you want to duplicate out of your storage box. So I'm just going to grab some souls and then wait for the other person to summon you in. So you can always tell if the summon is going to work if it says you're being summoned in as a dark spirit. If it doesn't say you're going to be summoned in as a dark spirit, the you will not be summoned in and the process will not work. Okay, so... Now you get to look at the beautiful loading screen. Oh yeah, it's got the amazing awkward silence too. No music or anything. You got a nice ring of sacrifice. There we go, and we're in. Okay. Now you are going to get summoned in as an invader and you're gonna run up to your designated buddy. Once you get up to your designated buddy, you're going to go ahead and go into your inventory, go to the items you'd like to drop, push leave selected, click A on the item you want to drop, or, and then click A on another item you want to drop, press Y, and press Yes. Those will leave those two items on the ground. And then your partner will go ahead and pick those up off the ground. Once you see both of those are picked up, go ahead and hover over Dark Souls, press the menu button, go to manage game and add-ons. Then you're going to scroll down to save data, Go to your profile, press A, go to delete from console, and then press A again. Then you're just going to go ahead and load back into Dark Souls. Now you know how to uh, duplicate one stack of items at a time. Now. I'm going to show you how to duplicate multiple stacks of the same item at a time. So what you're going to want to do is have your friend place down their red sign. Then you're going to go over to the bonfire, rest at that, grab the stuff out of the storage box. Then you're going to stand back up, go to your inventory, drop the stuff on the ground. Then you're going to sit back at the bonfire, go back into your storage box. Then you're going to drop those on the ground again, and you're going to repeat this process until the desired amount of souls are dropped. So I'm just going to do it one more time for good measure. So what I like to do is on the last stack, before dropping them, I like to summon in my partner, unless I become greedy and accidentally grab up the souls. So go ahead and just summon in your partner, and uh, wait for him to come in. Get them doggies loading, 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 loading. Wait a couple more seconds for him to come in. Okay, as soon as your buddy spawns in, just have him run up to you. Ah, there he is. So, he'll just uh, run on up here and grab all the stuff off the ground. So, go ahead and just pick these up. Okay, and then once he grabs all the stuff, you're going to do the same thing as before, go into Manage Game and Add-ons, go into your save data, delete your save data from the console, load back in, and you're done. So, now you know how to duplicate one stack at a time, and also multiple stacks at a time. If you enjoyed the video, please remember to like and subscribe to continue getting back to the basics.